Hello, hello, Aquarius. Thank you for being here. Thank you for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing to the channel. It means a lot. Please continue to do so. All links are below if you need to get in contact with me. Do keep in mind that I do a live show every Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday, 9.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. I also have tarot classes now. The link will be below or at the top of the chat. And um, I have an Amazon wish list. I know a lot of people were asking me about that. The Amazon wish list, uh, the link will be below also. So um, let's get into it. Thank you, God, for blessing each and every Aquarius with a clear, concise message from you for this week. All right, so let's see what the situation is for you, Aquarius, this week. Let's see what's going on for the Aquarius this week. What's going on for Aquarius this week? I heard money. Destiny. Okay, so something is destined. It's written in the stars. You can't get away from this. Uh, this is a part of your life cycle path. Um, some of you could be running from this, whatever it may be. And we'll try to get a card to clarify this. This also could be a destined meeting, being in the right place at the right time. This also could be, um, it could be love, you know, destined to meet your your soulmate, your uh, life partner here, also destiny in terms of your career. So we'll see what that is about, but do know that something is meant for you this week, Aquarius. Let's get the advice for you this week. What's the advice for Aquarius this week? The advice for Aquarius this week. I think it was supposed to be the other way around. I'm so sorry, guys. Um, so the advice uh, this week. The advice for the Aquarius this week. What is the, okay, yep, romance. Okay, so this might be love, Aquarius. For some of you, um, you know where you are in terms of your love life. If you don't have any prospects, yes, miracles do happen, but uh, today is Monday. This is a seven-day weekly reading. I don't know, it could happen, it could not. I don't know, your love life. Now put yourself out there. Put yourself in the place to meet other people, whatever or wherever that may be, online or in person. Um, yeah, it says look for a sign, okay? Look for a sign that um, this is your person, that you're supposed to be here. Um, go with the flow, okay? That makes it easier for the universe to put you in the right place at the right time to meet the right people in terms of love or career. We'll see what this is all about. All right, so... Um, Let's get the advice here. I'm um, excuse me, the outcome. The outcome for the Aquarius this week. Very nice romance. So some of you could be um <laughs> some of you it's a long time coming for some of you. So this is really, really good. Um, you're tired of being by yourself, you're tired of uh spending the holidays alone, or maybe with people you really don't want to. Let's see. The outcome is the three of swords. Maybe you're getting over heartbreak, uh getting out of isolation, getting out of um uh, heartache also, um, maybe, uh, getting out of a place of no communication or a breakdown in communication here. You've got the five of swords at the bottom of the deck here. Uh, it talks about, uh, tough times. It talks about ulterior motive. Also, it talks about the mind games. This could also be somebody thinking of you over and over again. They're waiting for you to reach out to them. They want, look for a sign that somebody has you heavily on their mind, or this is what you're doing, Aquarius. Family at the bottom of this deck here. Uh, someone that you have a family with, you used to have a family with, uh, somebody wants a family with you. Let's get into clarifying some of these cards here. What is destiny for the Aquarius this week? Why is the situation destiny for Aquarius? Destiny. Why is it destiny? The Empress. All right, because you're ready. You're abundant. You're open. You're ready. You're ready for love. You're ready to create. You're ready to start your own business or relationship. You are ready, okay? You're in a place of Empress. You're ready to nurture. You're ready to cultivate a relationship. Um, you're ready to communicate love. This is, wow, the sun card at the bottom of the deck. You are ready. You're in the path of, of alignment. Uh, the universe is smiling down on you because you're in, in uh, you're on the right path here. Uh, everything is going in the, in, on the right steps here. Also, it talks about finding a person who could uh, bring a lot of joy, contentment in your life too. This could be a new person. All right, so what is romance and why is romance here for the Aquarius? 
So for some of you could be finding love, okay? This is what you manifested. This is what you want. For some of you, if it's not what you want, that's okay. Uh, romance here. Romance. Why is romance here for the Aquarius? Why is romance here for the Aquarius? Okay. Uh, wow. The Ace of Cups. So this could definitely be new, Aquarius, for a lot of you. you I'm here in right place, right time. I'm, I'm here like... um. Like mundane places, you go into the gym, the grocery store. It's not about going to, you know, the meeting hall, the, the bar or the lounge or the club. Um, but it, it hurt like just it, around and about. Maybe that's why you have looked for a sign that you need to be somewhere or go somewhere different or you need to expand your horizons here. This is beautiful, Aquarius. Why is the Three of Swords the outcome? Why is the three of swords the outcome? If this is what you want to happen, Aquarius, if you want to find new love, new friendship, have someone in your life, I need you to put some hearts down below, okay, in the comment section so we can manifest collectively. We already have a lot of people, uh, I get a lot of emails, people are getting money coming into them. Uh, I'm just feeling the vibration of money for the Aquarius. In a lot of our readings, in the past readings, we're about money and manifestation. So we are manifesting corporately when we come together and we put that energy out there down in the comment section, sending me emails, all of that. Okay, so if you want to manifest love, if you want to get out of heartbreak, put some hearts down there in the comment section, okay? What is the Three of Swords? Why is it, okay, the Three of Swords? The Queen of Swords. All right, so... um all of these swords here, so it's definitely about maybe a situation where you felt like you were taken for granted. You felt like you were taken for granted because this also has something to do with money. I don't know if somebody took money from you, has money for that they need to pay, repay you. Um, you you giving you had giving your all. You cut something off. You cut somebody off here. Yeah, I knew it. Queen of Pentacles at the bottom of the deck. Um, somebody saw you as you know abundant, nurturing, giving, uh, having more than enough or very hard working in terms of your money. And they, they felt like they could um, masquerade for, for some of you. Like uh, maybe they wanted a family. They wanted to be with you long term. But all they really wanted was um, opportunity to maybe live off you, live with you, get money from you, ask you for resources. It says Aquarius, you have the opportunity. I heard some of you are going to fall in love with yourself also. You're going to fall more in love with you, what you have to offer, because some of you are understanding that you're a good catch, okay? Uh, you're understanding your worth now and what you bring to each and every table, whether it's platonic, familiar, or romantic, okay? So uh, I heard some of you, it's just going to be you falling in love with yourself. And for some of you, you're going to meet someone new, which is what some of you have manifest here. It says, look for a sign. Look for a sign that somebody is a user. They are an abuser and they put you in this place, the five of swords, the three of swords, to turn it into the queen of swords. They even pushed you to spirituality because you were trying to understand. You were trying to reconcile within your mind why you would meet somebody like this. Why would they even be in your life? Why would you even entertain this? Um, what did you do to, to, uh, earn this type of, uh, torture in terms of a relationship, how this person meant no good for you. Okay. And you were all good. You were, you wanted good. You wanted the best for them, for the relationship. So Aquarius, it looks like the queen of swords, you're getting to a place of your, your, she's like a mini tower because she cuts out all that is old because she, old because she understands she can't take the old into the new with her. So the queen of swords cuts out people, places, things because she understands, look, if I want newness, I can't take these people with me. I can't take this situation with me. I can't take this old mindset with me. I have to really sever ties with all of those things. So I can have new. So there is room for new. Uh, she is the executive in her life. Uh, she makes really good decisions. Uh, you will want someone like this on your side. And this is the energy that you're in because somebody put you in a place of the three of swords and the five of swords felt you, had you feeling heartbroken because you were taken uh, advantage of, you were taken for granted. Uh, there was defeat. You didn't win. You didn't get what you wanted out of the situation. Somebody took from you. Okay. They left you feeling depleted, lost, um, like you lost the battle. And some, some of you did. So Aquarius, it says that you're going to fall in love with yourself this week. Uh, there, there could be some destined meeting here, uh, maybe with you hanging out with family. Okay. Um, you're, you're, 
the outcome is you getting over this. You're really cutting out this heartbreaking situation where somebody played with you, manipulated you. So this is really good, Aquarius. Um, you, you, you're cutting out the five of swords. Also, this is somebody who, um, they say one thing, they do another. It's also somebody who you're not really communicating with. Or the communication is scattered, you know, it's in and out. It's hot and cold. That's because you weren't the only person. Also, they felt like they can get something from you. Uh, the five of swords also talks about just bad blood between the two of you, especially if there is money owed. Okay. I heard like money owed. I need my money. I want my money. I just want my money so I can never talk to you again is what some of you are uh, putting out there. Some of you, you could be dealing with somebody who, yeah, somebody wanted to marry you, get with you, be with you, be in the home with you because they knew that you would take care of things also. Uh, this is what I have for you, Aquarius. The advice here or the outcome is the queen of swords. So you get a real firm about the fact that maybe there was somebody else in the background, there was another love relationship here. Um, and you're cutting this person out. You're cutting this situation out. It doesn't, it doesn't suit you. It doesn't fit you. It, it adds no value to your life. If anything, you add a value to this person's life. You're in a place of the queen of pentacles, taking care of yourself, your body, your mind, your spirit. You could be meditating more, eating healthier, looking better. You have some beauty regimen, skincare regimen. Your hair is growing. Uh, you can even start a garden or you have several plants in your home. There's so much going on with you, Aquarius, that you just don't have time for this, even for my uh, male Aquarius. So thank you. Many blessings to you, Aquarius. All links are below. Uh, again, we have a live show Tuesday and Thursday, Sunday, tarot classes. The link will be below if you want to learn tarot so you can pull cards for yourself. You also could think about me this holiday season the amazon wish list will be below also and do not forget to put those heart emojis down in the comment section so that we can manifest corporately new love okay either for self or just a new love coming in okay look for a sign aquarius okay thank you many blessings to you